Hello guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. It's me, Evelia Sadulio, a teacher in profession whose passion is to do video tutorial. Today, I will teach you how to copy table from Microsoft Excel 2016 to Microsoft Word 2016. Okay, I will teach you three, three style or let us say three options in uh, copying the table. Okay, let us now open the table that we wanted to copy. So I have here a TOS. So we wanted this to be copied in Microsoft Word. So I will now open Microsoft Word and blank document. Since the, the orientation of the Microsoft Excel table is in landscape orientation we will also change the orientation of this so let's say click layout and click orientation and change that to landscape and there you have it you can also change the size of the band paper instead of short band paper you can change also to legal size and for the margin, you can also try to customize the margin. You can, instead of 2.54 centimeter or this is equivalent to 1 inch, you can decrease the, the size. Let's see, 1.74 by 1.7. 1.7. Okay, after setting the, the Microsoft document, let us now go back to the table. So what you will do is to highlight all the, the things that you wanted to copy. So let us decrease the size so that it's easy for us to highlight. So just click the top uh, row, then click Shift and arrow downward to highlight the, the values up to the last. Let us say that one. We wanted all the things to be copied to Microsoft Word. Then click copy. Then click Microsoft Word. Then you can click home. Then here we have different paste op options. So you can either paste this one keeping the source formatting you can also use the format from this, the destination style you can have here a uh, keep for uh, source formatting but that includes link here link and the destination cell then this one picture and this one only text so it depends on uh, what you want. Let's say, for example, uh, you wanted to use the destination style. The table will look like this one. So there are so many things that you can do just to, to format the table. So it will be difficult for you. So I think you can uh, change the paste style. And if you wanted it to use a picture, you can also click picture. Okay, the goodness of this, it will eventually uh, be accommodated on the band paper and what is not good in this, once you print this one, file print, it will show you the lines of the Microsoft Excel table. So it's not good to use this one when you copy all the, all the data. It's good, I think, if you will only 
uh, use the table, this one, and uh, there's no need for you to eat it. That's the, the goodness of picture. Let us say you do not need to change the data. So automatic, you have the table. But if you wanted the, the values of this, there are words or numbers that you wanted to change, then picture is not good option. So what we're going to do is to go back. Then what are we going to do is the first one, keep source formatting. Okay, that's it. Uh, you can uh, edit here. Okay, if you will try to click, you can edit this one. Oh. And change that to other uh, numbers or whatever. So what we need to do is just to accommodate the table on the paper. So let us try to find the edge. So the last part so that we can decrease the size. Uh, where is the last part here? Just find the last part or that edge of the table and then click left click and then you can just drag it upward in order that the table will be accommodated in the first page so still it's not accommodated you can uh, change the margin if you wanted you can still decrease the margin on the top let's see one cm on the top and at the bottom you can also have one cm okay let's see if it will already be accommodated okay it is now accommodated in our microsoft word and then uh, you can now start uh typing or editing something in this table if you want it Okay, and sample, I want that to be in large fonts, font size. Okay, and then bold. Okay, you can do the same with the others. And uh, if you are done editing, then you wanted it to be printed. The goodness of this is that when you print this type of option, The lines from the Microsoft Excel will not be copied in this Microsoft Word document. That is the goodness of keeping the source or keeping the, the style of the source, meaning we follow the formatting from the Microsoft Excel. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I hope you learned something from this video if you are uh, that if this is your first time to watch my video, don't hesitate to subscribe my channel. And if, if, if you think this is useful to you, then uh, do not hesitate to, to click the like button. Thank you so much for watching. See you on my next video.